Welcome back to Mortal Shell with me and my wife, Aldo. Hey. So at this point, we just need, I guess, swords and weapons and other mortal shells. So basically just explore and see if we can find any of those. First thing we're going to do is go towards the horrible growling noises in this cave. <laughs> oh, that's a lot of traps. Yeah. I wonder if it'd be helpful to lure it out here. It might be something friendly. You don't know. All the huge animals we've seen so far have been friends, except for the fake, fake, fake um, frogs of poison cloud. It could be friendly. There's a lot of bodies here that say it's not, though. Hmm. Maybe that's just because they had bad vibes. That's true. If you go out there with like really good vibes, they're just going to be friends. Looks kind of like a werewolf. Hmm, yeah. Werewolf romance time, mayhaps? Oh. Oh, I don't like the hands. Oh. Ah, so that cannot be parried. Ah. Should I just keep picking two attacks, backing up, hardening? Yeah. Play it safe? If I get one more hit, I'm dead, though. Hold on. Oh, oh right. It doesn't... It doesn't... <gasps> I thought maybe it would save in that menu. Apparently, it doesn't. Nope. No pauses, <sighs> never. I was thinking if you can't even see the world in that menu, surely you're safe. <laughs> yeah. No, it's not. You're not. You never save. Yeah, so I need to check if I have any healing items and put them on my quick belt quickly. I've kept your flesh safe, family. Thanks. Kitos. I'm basically a chlorified fridge. <laughs> uh, I think it's just the one. Yeah, that's stamina. Speed. That poisons me. Yeah. Just one healing item. I was just about to say, don't run into the traps. Oh, fuck. Oh. Nom nom. I don't think I want that body back. Do I? I don't know. I guess you do. I mean, I guess it's just kind of there, huh? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it worked <laughs> out. Well, you come back with full health. Peace is a misconception. A misconception of what? Oh, wait, really? Oh, 
I guess you lived though, huh? I lived! I lived, bitch! Don't roll into the traps, girl. Oh, right. I should try to pull it into the traps. See if it'll follow me. It probably won't follow probably me out here. Probably won't, huh? Nope. No. Its health is going to restart if I go back, right, and, like, heal. Probably. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. I think it might be too hard for me to take. Like, I can do it, but do I want to? Yeah, mayhaps not. At the very least, we probably want to explore just to, like, gather more healing items. Yeah. Should I check if it's got full health? It, I'm sure it's restored its health. But I gotta know. It would be so cheap if... Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> it would be too cheap. Yeah. Okay. I don't know. Let's go this direction? Yeah. The old prisoner sits contentedly atop his perch, awaiting the newest. The unborn must be greeted with gifts, but gifts they will bestow in return for unwavering loyalty. The unborn. We might have missed something, huh? Yeah. Oh yeah, this seems important. Yeah. Ooh, cat! <gasps> cat! I think, can we talk with it? Oh, pet! <laughs> you can pet the cat, that's even better! Oh, that's oh a weird looking God. cat, but I love it. Uh, see, that's a that's a good fucking game. That's good. Game of the year, mortal pets. <laughs> immortal pets. <laughs> immortal pets. Mortal shell. Immortal pet. Heck yeah. Ooh. There's an item up there. Uh, I don't know what kind of fall damage is in this game, but it's probably not generous. Yeah, let's talk first, huh? Specimen. My oh my, aren't you a fatphobic caricature? Yeah. And what if on the inside? You must be a gentleman. Certainly not one of those boorish fanatics. Welcome then. I'll warp some tea. In the meantime, why not take a look at my wares? I'll gladly accept any tar. As payment. So we could buy healing items. Ah. Moonshine. Right, if I go out and gather a bunch of... Uh, what was it called? Resolve? If I go out and gather a bunch of resolve, we could do some parries with that boss. Mm. I don't know if it's worth it. Some of them are parryable, but... Yeah. I mean, can you... How can you pull off that move where you can heal from parrying? Is it just any time? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I think if you do the parry counterattack, it'll heal. Nice. That sounds like it will help a bunch. Large bolt. Just as if the bolt is unused, discarded like rubbish. Such a cumbersome missile must have been forged in Muradin. The Neoretics had little desire for convenience, preferring to invent that which would challenge its wielder. That's interesting. We're already extremely familiar with it. Huh. Does that tell us something about the character that we've inhabited or something? Maybe. Like if it's a... Maybe it's used for crafting... Our weapon. 
level ups. Maybe it's missile. It's a missile. So this is like something that'd be shot out of a bow, though, isn't it? I don't know. Scripture of Euphoria. We don't know what it does, but it costs 500, so I'm not going to buy that. <laughs> we could buy another loot. What's this? Quenching Acid. Acid used to enhance weapons. Falgrim is a crumbling remnant of a fledgling kingdom. Amongst the ruin, few weapons remain that aren't chipped and rusted. Yet by some miracle, this quenching acid restores them. Restores them? I thought that was like a bad poison effect to a blade, but it sounds oh. like it's for restoring a weapon. Is there durability or... I don't know. Bronze bell. No idea what it does. I guess the only thing we'd want to buy is probably some roasted rat. What does it do? Oh, it just heals 35 over 10 seconds. Oh, well, that's good. Yeah. Um. Oh, it consumes resolve. Oh. I don't like oh. that. Maybe we just want to, like, find some mushrooms, eh? Yeah. I want to go look at the... Um, after this, getting this item, I want to go look at that work workbench and see if large bolt really is something used for like crafting okay should i get this item though yes how i don't know is there a jump i don't think there is a jump i guess i'll just dash yeah like a pro i don't know if the hardening helped at all <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, bronze bell. That's one of the things that was going to cost a lot of money. Mm-hmm. Let's use it, huh? Yeah. 10% bonus to tar found for six minutes. Ooh, nice. Uh, hmm. What if you fall, but you harden? Might have reduced the damage we took. Probably. Oh, right. I can parry. <laughs> oh, wait, no, I I can't parry because I don't have enough resolve. Oh, yeah. I don't want to complain, but this seems awful little a lot like not going to the workbench. Well, I'll have you know that I forgot about the workbench immediately. <laughs> In fact, I'm not even exactly sure where we are. I think we got to go back on the right to get to where we came from. I don't know. I, do we? Actually, I think maybe I do go this way. I don't really know. I think if you circle the other way, you will find the way go up. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. This is the hole that leads in. <gasps> this we is came the out hole. from this the other way. Oh, right. This is the hole where you buy a few times till we realize that's not a, not nice a good place hole. to go. Not a good hole. Some say all holes are good holes. I say not all go holes are good holes. Don't over end up. Uh, so where was the workbench? Upstairs? Just go up. Yeah. In one of them rooms. There. Molten spike, quenching acid, tools. Solemn offering. Okay. So, so no. Spikes. Yeah, spikes, but not bolts. Okay. Misremembereth. They...
Oh, does this actually lead down to the ground? Uh. Oh, we can do a little ambush kind of thing. This is bad. Uh -oh. At least one of them died. Rotten food. Ugh. Okay, we have enough for one parry. hard and parry at the it's same glowing time. glowing red right now, so you can't parry any of those. Wait, what? Sorry? It's glowing red right now, so you can't parry any of those. Like the thing on my back? Yeah. Oh, that's normal. That, that doesn't mean you can't parry it. Oh. The redness appears on the enemy itself? Oh, I see. Aha! <laughs> Wait, <laughs> can I not hard? Why, why can't I harden? Cool down? The cooldown's always really short, though. Like, Maybe you, you got seconds. hit with like something that like prevents it. Or can you not harden after you've re-entered your body? Oh, God. Oh, God. Yeah, I still can't harden. The only status down there is the one that gives us more tar for six minutes. Hmm. Okay. That... I, I mean, I should just go back, right? Yeah, go to Big Sis. <laughs> <laughs> uh, do you remember where the hole was? Because I don't... No. Wasn't it this way? I don't know where anything is. I don't know what I'm doing. Ooh. Oh, uh, that's the screaming of the thing. So it's just right over here. Oh, uh, yeah, the door. Thank you. I don't, I've already forgotten the name of the thing. Me too. Wait. I still can't? Can't harden? No. Something must be wrong, right? Yeah, sure. For sure, for sure, for sure. Yes! It works okay. now. Okay. Yeah, it, it was just a bug. I'm pretty sure when you take your body a, a second time, you still can harden. Because I think I would have noticed that if it didn't. Yeah. Okay. Do you think we can make it more than, like... 20 feet out the door? <laughs> I hope so. All those things are apparently chests. Because oh. they say... Nothing. They say nothing at all. Chest, chest is, locked. is locked. Whoa. I wonder if 
my controller is being funky or something. It just kept me running forwards even when I wasn't pressing forwards. Huh. Weird stuff happening. Cursed game, cursed game. I guess I won't parry if I don't need to heal. There's not really any point. Yeah. Save your resolve. That'll give me some more resolve, but I don't really need it. You build up resolve pretty quickly. Yeah. Oh, I should explain. Um, off camera, right before starting, I realized that there's, um, I guess, sort of a combo system. Basically, if you do one quick attack and then a strong attack, quick, strong. It does that that like sweep up that if I do just two quick attacks it looks like this so you can see the difference there that whoosh. and then there's a different attack that happens if you do two quick at two quick attacks and then a strong attack one two and then strong you like use it as a club and then nothing happens if you do it three times because if you do a quick attack three times it's basically like the whole quick attack cycle one two three The more you know. So what we're actually doing here is just basically very extreme mushroom foraging. <laughs> we're looking for the healing mushrooms while some dudes try to kill us. <laughs> now would be a good time to parry. And that artist looks like they want to give us some bloods. Yes. Slurp, slurp. Oh, hello. <laughs> they just kind of appeared out of nowhere, huh? Well. Yes. I still need to try the Harden Parry. And see if that's actually effective. Oh. Just stamina. All stamina. Okay, I think that's where we went before. Yeah, we went down that way. So we could go back there. Because we haven't gone that far down there. But, I don't know. I feel like going a different direction. Yeah. I, I mean, I guess, like, did I just go in a circle? I think you kind of did, yes. Does that mean there's nowhere to go but the way that I originally went? No. Because you haven't gone straight left from here. You just went, like, up there. Isn't this the only way to go? Oh, there... It's a cul-de-sac? There's no other way? Yeah, huh. this is all dead ends except for this oh. enemy in here. Okay. Yeah, I guess so. Guess you just gotta go back, back, back. Healing item! I really like that club attack. It's just really cool looking. Yeah. Gotta be on the lookout for big frogs. Alright. I got my big frog goggles on. This is basically the area that you explored a lot in the first episode. Oh. 
Nice. I'm married to a gamer wife. I hate that. It's sad. <laughs> Oh, wait, what are those things? All new! All new enemies! Haven't been here before, huh? Oh, they're toughies, huh? Oh, they got tildies, huh? You got this girl. Oh, they're aggressive. They're scary. Uh, yeah. Oh. Hmm. Yay! We lived. <laughs> Whew. Yeah, I thought I was gonna die. Those were scary. Turns out, going through holes, you always get thrown in the middle of a bunch of enemies that are real fucking mad at you. I'm gonna try dodging. Okay, well, I, I don't know if I should dodge something if I can't even parry it. Mm. I mean, I guess what are you supposed to do? Something you can't parry other than dodge it? I mean, yeah. That looks like a sperm. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, it does. You know what? You're right. But if you God God help me if you call anything that doesn't actually look like a sperm a sperm, then it's freaking game over. Playtime over. Don't worry, I have a high standard for my spermy analogs. <laughs> No, no long-winded death noises. Yeah. We appreciate people who die quietly in this household. token. That's new. Connection to the spirit realm. Hmm. That sounds suspiciously like online play, doesn't that it? That does, that does. I was just about to say, so scared, so scared. Oh, it's not. Getting Sharkle oh. Harden will boost the damage of your next attack? Probably. Yeah.
That wasn't great. Huh, that was a harden and a parry and it didn't really parry, but the harden worked. Yeah. Dumb. Oh! Oh, I'm Blamo. married to a gamer! A wife of gaming skills! Heck yeah! We have no more healing. I wonder how many poor loots they had to abuse to record all those different sort of unique loot sounds. Yeah. <laughs> what are you gonna do? Um, I'm just gonna like be throwing a loot down the stairs today and recording the sounds. Okay. Have fun. Yes, come. Oh, two of the big ones? Uh, uh -oh. I think we just got one at one time. Ah. Where did you come from? Hello? Okay. Doing your frog lookout. Yeah, <laughs> a lot of small ones. I think that might be another spawn point. <gasps> oh! It's not on, though. Like, that's the same mask that the person... What's their name? Um, The firekeeper? <laughs> I just call her Sis. Yeah, that's the same face as Sis, and that's the same face that we also saw drawn like this, like at the very beginning of the game. Yeah, but yeah. It, this one's not lit up, so I'm not sure what that means. Hmm. Yeah, I don't to, know. Like, do we need to do something to activate it? Oh. Oh? New area. I'm scared. Sister. Okay, so like, are we gonna spawn back? Like, should I go check if it's awake? Sure. I, I gotta know. It is. Ah. Okay, so... Can we fast travel? Like, are we gonna spawn back here by default? Don't know. What if know. we want to go back to the other place? I have no idea how anything works. <laughs> and I love it. And we love it. That one doesn't look right. Huh? It doesn't sound right either. Huh? S Is that like sis, but like bad sis? Sis, sister? Sister? Oh, she's just sleeping. Okay. Ah. For another taste, foundling. Okay, we're fine. <laughs> Not so hasty. 
not all places are as friendly as Fulgrim. There won't be any merriment around the bonfire here. Bonfire? Only the dead call this place home. All that remains are scavengers gnawing on bones. An intruder like yourself will not be welcome. So then, would you like another sip? Hey! No one wants you at this party. Anyway, you want a drink? <laughs> hey, we can afford another upgrade. Oh? Oh my god, 20 glimpses? Jesus Christ. 8, 6, 15. Okay, some of the others don't take nearly as much. Anyway, killing two enemies in quick succession resets your hardened cooldown. That's really eh. But eh. I guess. I guess. I mean, yeah, it's so cheap and everything else is so expensive. Yeah. Did it give us new text about the character? Oh, crap. Sorry, I skipped it. Um, we can probably go back and read it? Yeah. He ushered me deeper into the labyrinth. It must have been dug by a thousand hands. I ignored much of what he said until he called my name. Smiling, he forgave me for the crime I would soon commit. It was all etched in stone, he assured me. These were the ravings of a madman. A uh, workbench? That's the same as the bench, right? Mm, this yeah. anvil? Yeah. Healing item! I thought the statue was a human. Oh. <laughs> That's what I do to Harry Potter books. Rip them apart. Aha! Uh -huh. Mina olen velhonnut. <laughs> Velho means wizard in Finnish, right? Yes. Okay, I got it right. When did you learn wizard for Finnish? Oh. It was, um, I think it was used in Duolingo quite a bit for some reason. But actually, <laughs> why be a wizard? I want to be a witch. What's the word for witch? Uh, noita. Noita. Oh, God, not Hattern. No, Hattern, you. Hattern. Hattern. Fuck. So can I, like, leave? I think if you give up all your tar, you can leave. Can you eat me, please? Like, there's no way I'm going to be able to beat them, right? Um, probably not. Probably not, yeah. I guess I'll try to do some parries, see how much damage it does. Yeah. Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> Fuck. You only give up your glimpses if you travel back, right? Um... And I don't have any glimpses. Oh. But I also don't have it on my quick menu. Fuck! Well... Oh. Why? Why? Oh, fuck. I can't be- it can't be used right now. Oh... Okay, I want to get one parry. Come on. Can't parry that. Fuck! Too early. Yeah, it looks like it's about to come and then they slow down the bastards. <laughs> Classic Dark Souls trick. Classic. Not that Dark Souls invented it. I'm sure that existed before. <laughs> but that was the first time I, like, really, really clearly saw that that was a thing they do to mess with you in hard boss fights. Uh, 
Oh no. Call the worm fish? Yes, please. <laughs> what does that mean? They take you away? The worm fish takes you away? I think so. Because they're what took us away from this place when we were in the tutorial. Oh. Eat me. We lost like a thousand tar. Whatever. It's okay. Trans means on the desk and she is stepping on every damn key. <laughs> she jumped on me and it was very scary. I was having a real life battle of human versus nails that scrape up cat food, poop every day. <laughs> now question, am I avoiding these boss fights prematurely? Like, are they supposed to be really, really hard or should I continue and see if there's like some basic stuff I'm missing? I think I'm just going to continue. Yeah. Because, like, at the very least, we can, like, forage some mushrooms and, like, get some more healing items going. Should I hold on to the spectral token? I guess so. Uh, I guess. For, for like, like a boss fight? I mean, it's gets you more... I'm sorry. Uh, It'll boost the damage of your next attack oh, after right. being hardened. I'm sorry, I forgot it. I mistook it for the bronze thing, which will increase your tar collection. But yeah, those you should save for a boss fight. Oh, that's a new enemy. Oh, they just ripped a sword out of their chest. Oh, they throw <laughs> it. That is in my face. So they're a ranged character. Huh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> they're angry. I took some video of Transpian the chicken insert in the video. Thank you. She's just being the cutest little staring kitty. Uh oh. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> oh you fucker. Oh. That's really cool. I hate that. That's really cool. That is really cool. That's like I'm gonna die, but like, fuck you so hard. Yeah. <laughs> it's like how bees die. I'm gonna sting you, rip out my entire insides, die. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, there's more. Oh. to dodge <laughs> you got the resolve for a parry fuck trying to parry oh. no oh fuck ah oh. What do you think's in their head to make it so nasty? Um, the thoughts of an of a of a of a man. Cis straight man. <laughs> Cis straight man. Oh. <laughs> that's toxic masculinity embodied. Truly toxic. You're 
toxic. I'm blocking your tweets. You have to resolve for parries. Two of them. Two of them. Ah! I always do it too early. That was a very generous parry window. Yeah. Damn, they got lots of health, huh? All right. Throw your head. Kill them before they throw their head. How about that? Oh, are they gonna explode? No. Oh. Thoughts contained. <laughs> if you don't give them the chance to tweet them out, you're safe. See, that's why you should de-platform toxic people. Exactly. I'll I'll, be very, I, don't, I don't like the look of that. <laughs> yes, be very, very wary. Maybe I just shouldn't go in there. Maybe if there's other ways, go there first. Mm. there might be some randomization with when they throw their head just oh. kind of when they feel like it yeah <laughs> oh fuck no oh no that might kill me that's really bad no it'll be over before large bolt Oh? Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, I'm out of here. Yeah. Jesus Christ. I don't think I'm, yeah, not going to lose anything because we didn't have any glimpses in the first place. Mm. We're still <laughs> poisoned? Come on. Ah. <sighs> so, we have a lot of things that could maybe give us glimpses. I don't know if it'd be enough for any of those, though. Mm. Like, what do we have? Tiny bit of tar. I thought we had more stuff. Glimpse of wisdom. Oh, we haven't even used that yet. Oh. How much wisdom do you think we're going to get? Don't know. Or glimpses or whatever. I guess I'll use one. Yeah. Two glimpses. That's not going to be anywhere near enough to get any upgrade. No. I think the minimum we need is like six. Ew. Yeah, six. Put your enemies off balance with a powerful kick. That's actually totally doable to get six. If we use mm -hmm. up the rest of our glimpses, we can get that. We need the tar though, but that shouldn't be hard either. Let's go for it. Yeah. Oh, plus 15. Oh, Whoa. Uh, hello. Okay. Um, what else do we have? Not rotten food. <laughs> <laughs> Refunds resolve on success the next parry. Oh, that would be useful. That's resolve, blah, 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 poison. So I guess just this for tar? Yeah. Minuscule. Ooh, yes. Oh, that's more glimpses. Oh. I don't know if we should, I don't think we should use more glimpses. We're not going to have the tar to back it up. Yeah. 
Uh, I guess I'll farm? Yeah. Just... Is this the safest place to farm? Question mark? Uh, no. Then we should go outside. But, like, can we teleport, or would I have to run all the way back? Or do you think just attack the enemies directly outside? Yeah, just directly outside. I don't think there is a teleport system, is there? Ooh, not yet, anyway. Not yet. But no one tell us. No one tell us if there is a system or not. We don't want to know, actually. We just ask things. Like dumb idiots, but we don't want to actually know anything. Knowing things sucks. Oh, Jesus. You got it in you to parry. Maybe if you can kill that one bitch. And then parry the other one. Where was I? <laughs> Although I don't need the health anymore. <laughs> no. <laughs> there does seem to be invis invincibility frames. Oh, big frog! Oh, fuck. Oh, wait, we're okay? I yeah. thought it poisoned me. Oh, I guess because you were hardened. It didn't hit you. Ooh, and we claim a glimpse. I like how they get scared and, like, fall down. <laughs> Some cool behavioral stuff. Yeah. I want to not have Tarnished Mask selected, because if I use it, oh boy. Yeah. It's going to hurt. Healing item. Have we gone this way yet? I don't think so. Yeah, no, I think we, yeah, we went through the door and then we never came out again. Except to check out that the spawn point is back. I really like the mechanic. Yeah. The fact that Perry's actually... <laughs> Bye. <laughs> hey, hey. Okay, that's a little dramatic, don't you think? <laughs> uh. <sighs> I love the fact that Perry actually works reliably, tells you when it's not going to work, and that it's like absolutely integral to healing. Yes. That's really cool. In that way, it's very much closer to um, Sekiro's stuff than like um, Dark Souls. Should I go in here? Sure.
Is that just a normal enemy? I think it's just a normal enemy. Oh. Let's go. Isn't it? No. Nope. <laughs> go, 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 go. Jesus Christ, <laughs> it looked kind of normal. Yeah. How much tar did you need for the for the 1, upgrade? Okay. <gasps> the land of the bats. Bats. I really hope they don't attack us. Please be friends. Batsy friends. Please be friends. Batsos. They're so cool looking. <laughs> bats are just dogs that fly. Oh, fuck. Yeah, uh, ran out of stamina. You can parry. Thank you. Ah! She rests within a tomb, the most vulnerable of the unborn. His protection is all he has left to offer. A loyal husk, he prays for her birth, refusing to rest no matter how tiresome his watch. Him. Yes, old doggy friends, just watching, just keeping an eye out. Oh. Fuck. oh god, oh god, oh god. And you've already been kicked out of your body, I think, so... Maybe just go back down, back down, back down. <laughs> Sis, we're coming! No, 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 not there. Right, that's the boss. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh. this game makes us really desperate, doesn't it? Yeah, We're really desperate. You're literally chomping on mushrooms to live. Oh, there's the frog. Oh, nice. Safe. Thank you. 
So when it hits your human form, it goes into a... Oh, fuck. Fog. Cloud. But if it hits your hardened form, it just goes splat. I think I'm gonna head in here. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ, I'm so desperate and... Oh. <laughs> I wonder if that's going to change, like, as we get more abilities and stuff, or if I'm going to be just as desperate for the whole thing. Well, I hope not just as desperate. Hopefully some ease will come. <laughs> oh, and remember the frog. I'll let you know if it comes close. Okay. You can parry if you want. Okay. Oh fuck, I tried to parry. Okay. Should I try to parry this? Yes. Yes. Shh. <laughs> Hush, little baby, don't say a word. I'm excited for new ability. Yeah. You're still going to go with the kicking one? I don't know. I'm going to see what else is available. Yeah. The Just two. For a short time after hardening, enemies killed have a chance to drop an additional glimpse. Versus, put your enemies off balance with a powerful kick. That sounds a lot more exciting. Yeah, and a lot more practical too. Like, I don't quite grasp what the other one means. Yeah. God, the sound design is really good at creepiness. Yeah. To kneel before the executioner's axe. Or the queen. An easy choice. For years I wore her sigil. Repeated all the oaths. But I always knew one day. No matter how many honors were bestowed upon me, I would escape. I notice it doesn't say how to do the kick. Hopefully you get a tutorial right uh, now. <laughs> for a small resolve cost, give your opponent a taste of your boot. Successfully kicking an enemy will stun them for a brief moment. X. Requires resolve. That's too little? I think we have a lot of moonshine. Well, not as much as I thought. <laughs> Damn, uh, it fools up. Full bar it uses up. Yeah, I'm sorry. Did that say for a bit of your freaking... That's as much as a parry. Yeah. That, that better be really, really good of a that kick. really, yeah, that really better knock the shit out of their heads. It says it'll only stun them for a brief time, though. It doesn't sound that good. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus Christ. By the way, it sounds like a good tactic, quote unquote, to drink all of the moonshine and then heal up here and then leave. Because I think resolve stays with you. Yeah, or, I mean, at least we might as well heal. How did I get hurt? Uh, might as well heal and then drink the moonshine? Should I do it superior? Yeah. Oh, I think oh, that's full. Oh, dang. Maxed. Oh, it didn't hurt your health. Oh, is that what hurt me? Does, does this hurt yeah. you? Yeah. At the cost of their health. Aha. Uh -huh. Ah, and the other one is because it's superior, it doesn't that come at a cost for health. No impurities. Okay. Okay, well, I think this is a good place to end the episode, so I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when we return... Uh, Kicking Fest starts. 
Yeah. A boot to you, a boot to me. 